Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, my name is Miss Tamika. I upload video I upload videos once a week, which is Sunday, and then I also throw in a bonus video throughout the week. And if you're here to see what fits in my new Coach Cassidy, uh, my new Coach Large Cassidy bag, then please keep watching. So I'm sure y'all done watched the unboxing of this particular item. I actually purchased two items in that particular unboxing and it was the 1941 uh, black with um, gold rivets clutch, the 1941 uh, line because as you can see it has your hang tag here. In this video I'm going to show you what fits here in this particular bag and also the clutch I think I'm gonna start off with the bag first and then we'll do the clutch last so here is the bag the features of the bag you have your gold hardware here on the front and it is a turn lock turn it up and it's how you lock it and you turn it sideways and this is how you open it it's the same exact model as the small crossbody but like I said it wasn't the right type of leather it was the I think cross grain leather it wasn't the soft smooth leather and that's what I wanted in that particular small bag in the unboxing when I went online it was sold out so when I saw that this was I think like $20 a little over 20 something dollars extra bag retail for 89 and this here was 101 so you do the math it wasn't that big of a difference so I was like okay let me go ahead and order and see how this bag actually looks in person there's a little big for me because I wanted it I wanted it to be a you know like a small crossbody bag now I was like okay if it's not the small like the mini one I had maybe it's medium this is more so on the large side like it states in the description but again I wanted to order it just to see for myself I didn't care for that small particular bag because you carry a lot of stuff and you really not into downsizing then this would be the perfect bag for you in your inside again you have the soft suede I guess this is suede or uh, I don't know what's the other thing but I, it's soft and it's smooth so here you have your inside pocket you do have a back pocket which has your coach instructions or coach uh, care instruction instructions here in the back and you have your front inside pocket and this pocket here is where you probably would throw like your uh, catch-all stuff like your cell phone gum pen and stuff like that also came with these little packet things fill it up and I did end up repurchasing this bag here and so that video will be up sometime soon reorder the bag because in that first video as y'all saw it did come damaged so i was like okay i like the bag a whole lot well not liked i love the bag a whole lot so i ended up saying okay i'm gonna order one more time and she was really really nice they ended up overnighting it to me so i did get it really fast and it came of course in, con in good condition that's why i ended up keeping it i do have my coach card keys my new coach um, card case so we're going to place that in there and we're going to put that in the back pot the back part so what I'm going to do is I'm going to tilt the camera down so y'all can focus mainly on the bag okay so don't mind the silverness here on my table that's only to give me that reflecting light uh, to my face here is the inside so we're going to go ahead and place my lip gloss which is the Fenty Fussy Gloss I'm going to uh, place my bond number nine lipstick and we also going to place my uh, what is it Louis Vuitton pochette okay. that's all in your back pocket in here my Weight Watchers we're going to place that in the front pocket what else I have a dollar I have some mentos we're going to place that here in the front in the back pocket as well Cause that's more so the biggest pocket here in the bag and i am going to place my coach i mean mm, my gucci wallet in the bag as well and look at that gucci 
against that uh, burgundy suede. Looks really cute. So we're gonna place that in there. And we also have a few more lip products, the same stuff that I always carry in my bag. We have all of that in there. And let's see what else. I have my Kylie lip gloss and we're gonna put that in the bag as well. And see the bag closes really nicely. Just say we're gonna go ahead and carry this as a wallet and we're gonna place that in the front. Let's see how that looks. So this is here. It did make this flat bulge a little so we're gonna go ahead and take that out and then we're gonna close it. And I'm not gonna take the straps. Well, I don't know. Maybe I am gonna have to. So I am gonna, I'll take the, the plastic off so we can show you how this will look, buddy. Okay, so here is the gold hardware. So everything is off of the bag. I'm going to do some modeling shots so y'all can see. So here is the bag uh, using the two straps. Just say you want to carry it crossbody. Here is the bag crossbody. So it still feels nice crossbody, but I would have preferred to have had the smaller bag. But as you can see, it still looks nice crossbody. Prince, I think I'm like 5'1", five 5'2". Five but I don't know if I would carry this particular bag crossbody only because it's kind of big. So if I was to carry this bag, I think I would probably carry it like this. I don't know because it seems like it's one of those bags that looks right carrying it like this. It doesn't have any feet at the bottom. This leather is so soft. I would prefer to have this in a smaller version, but like I said, it was all sold out because once I read the description of these particular bags, because like I said, I didn't know it was two different leathers on this bag. I thought when I saw the bag and that color, I thought that was the same type of leather, but unfortunately it's not and that probably is my fault because i should have read you know the description but i thought it was the smooth leather yeah. here's the bag and you have room for more stuff because i'll show you in the inside that you need more and i forgot to mention you guys it do have a back pocket so let's just say you don't want to put it in your front pocket you can place your cell phone back here what I'll do is i'm gonna turn it around and I'm gonna go ahead and place it in my front flat pocket. As you can see, it can fit. And I forgot to mention my new AirPods. So I will go ahead and throw that in the bag too. And I didn't know that my Bond number no. nine lipstick got all scratched up, y'all. I don't know if you can see it, but I didn't know that. It should have came with like a little cloth like a little cloth, lipstick cloth bag, but it didn't. So next time I buy another one, I'll know to like keep it wrapped or something. I don't know, like to put it in one of those cloth bags. Yeah. So, so like I said, if you want to carry it like this, like I said, I'm really short, so I would never carry it like this because as you can see, it's way too long for me. I wanted to show you guys how it would look just in case you would want to carry it like that here is some modeling shots so y'all can see how the bag looks so now what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna go ahead oh and then i didn't mention it has your gold hang tag right here, here is the bag again i love this gold against this black it just looks so beautiful so what i'm gonna do now is i'm gonna put this to the side and I'm going to go ahead and show you the clutch. I said I got the clutch because I'm that type of person. I like to grab and go. I don't like to worry about grabbing a big bag all the time. And like I said, if I'm going to work, I like to carry something small. Because who wants to carry their 
you know, nice bags to work and have to worry about locking it up or keeping it in your car. So like I said, these here are perfect for those particular reasons when you don't want to carry one of your good bags is I'm going to grab one of my card cases. I'll just show you what I will carry in here. Let's see. Let me grab my Gucci wallet. So I have a lot of change. So right here I have my card. So I place I'll place that here in your front pocket right here. So we're going to put that there. And then also I have a few bills. Let me see. I have another dollar. So I'm going to go ahead and put that dollar towards this. So this here is $3. I didn't even know I had that. So we're going to put the money here in the zipper part because, you know, I feel like that's where it's nice and safe. I'll take this change that I have and we're going to place that in the zipper part. Go ahead and move it around. So the zipper part, I would probably use that for change and money. So now I'm gonna grab, uh, let me see. Now I'm going to grab my keys because I'll grab my BJ's card. Go ahead and place that inside of the wallet, like in the back part where you can place cards. I'm going to also place my driver's license in that area because of course you will need your driver's license. So you can only put two cards at a time. I'm not sure if you can, let me just check, cause I'm sure you can stack them, but I don't think I would. So here, um, I got a gift card. So you can put two cards back here. It was a little tight going in. So not sure if you will want to put two cards on top of each other. What I will put in here would be like my driver's license and one of my, probably my debit card. Let's see what else I will put in here. Uh, let's see if we can fit a lip gloss. Now I'm going to try the Laneige lip gloss because it is flat. So we're going to put that in there. Okay, it's feeling kind of funny with the Laneige lip gloss. So let me see, what else can we put in here, y'all? I'm not sure what else we can put in here. Okay, so the keys, I'm not going to sit here and, and take each one of the rings off. Like, I'm not going to sit here and take the keys because as you can see, they are attached. But I did see somebody, what they did was they had attached their key ring on here. I think what they did was they took this hair apart, like this little, mm, took it and but in the back secure, secure on your um, wristlet. So for me, I always take, take my key, my driver key off of this because like I said, I don't like this hanging out of my ignition. Normally just uh, detach my key. That's why I have this on there. So this here, I can detach my keys from this because of course you don't want this hanging from your ignition. So I would just go ahead and start my car and use it like that and then when i'm done or getting out the car i will just take this and attach it to this and there you go let me show you like the detail on this is beautiful you guys like they have coach here on that little circle d ring you have genuine uh glove tan leather right here across the front then you also have coach hair on the back. And you guys, I am so in love with this 1941 tag. Like I think all the coach bags should come with that. Like this is so cute. Now this here, I am gonna get a hot stamp with my initials on it. So I can't wait to go to Linux Mall and get that done. So like I was saying, I probably would use the back pocket for, you know, like receipts, like a catch all spot to throw some receipts in there. But if I don't want to place them in there, you know, for whatever reason, I can place them here in my front pocket. So, see what else. I know I can't carry these in there. Let me see. Just the way it's made. Like, no, I can't. And I'm not going to force it. So, here I also have a front. You also have a front pocket here as well. Like right here. I'm trying to think what else what I could carry in here. The leather on here is so soft. And here it has room for it to expand if you do want to place some stuff in here. But I'm trying to see what could I place in here. Say we're going to carry this particular lip gloss and we're going to take the cards out. Let's say we just take the cards out. 
so you do have room for your lip gloss and this protects so i have two lip glosses here in the front and i'm gonna go ahead and close it so as you can see it closed really nice and it doesn't look wonky or like it's not bulging out on the leather or anything like that to just show you so instead of putting the cards in the front i probably would place them here in the back so i can still bring them if for some reason i need them so now it did bulge just a little bit but it's expected because the wallet is made to expand as you can see goodness you guys this thing here is so cute now let's just say we are going to go ahead and place this in here and I have my car key on here so this can fit like you know like I said if I wasn't carrying these keys here and this I will have room and then I also have room to actually stick my ear pods in so it fits here in the bag let me show you so I have room to close the bag and voila there you go everything is in here everything you need I'm just in love with this little um this hair I know I love this hair is a keeper for me I'm a still still not sure about this one but this one here is the keeper because I like the fact that you know you have everything you need and I'm sure uh I can put a lot more in here but I'm just not I just don't know what to put in here offhand. I probably wouldn't carry lip glosses in here. Uh, I probably could carry the Laneige one. But let me see. So yeah, it can fit here in the back. Like I have it tucked in the back. And I can still close the bag, the little pouch. But I don't think I would probably carry that. Like I said, when I grab this, I would just mainly carry what I need like my credit cards my keys and as you can see my keys is on here and they're not going anywhere because like I said I like as you can see I placed it through let me see so yeah like I said I'm not sure what else to put in here so I just want to give y'all a really quick like a really quick idea on what can fit and like I said I love this gold in the inside of this particular pouch soft you guys like so soft and you can place other things on here as well like i'm sure i can put my let me see i know i love my teddy bear charm so i can put my teddy bear charm on here and have it as a bag charm it is a little heavy but if that's if i wanted to you know place that on here but i don't see me putting it on here but i just wanted to show y'all for the sake of the video but it do look cute on the bag so if i missed anything on this particular um pouch let me know i did look on the coach outlet website they don't even have this on there but i did see other colors so you may want to just keep stalking the coach outlet website just in case you guys want to purchase one for yourself we're going to take everything out the bag so y'all can see what was in the bag so it's halfway empty so like I said, we had the AirPods. It didn't have a zipper, it just had a, a pouch, like a flat back here. So it doesn't have a zipper in the back. And then you had this stuff here. Gum, I mean not gum, but mentos. And then you had your pen. I had my lipstick. That lipstick with the black and gold looks cute. The front, you had your phone and your pouch. Yo, this leather smells so good, you guys. It smells like leather between this and this. It smells like leather up in here. So with that being said, you guys, if y'all are loving my coach handbag videos, please give this video a big thumbs up because you know it helps out my channel. And also before you go, please don't forget to click on that subscribe button and that notification bell so y'all can be notified each week when your girl uploads videos. And until next time, I will talk to you later. Bye.